Good morning YouTube Mine Explorers. Julie and Tom here. We were driving up this road. We saw mine up here another mile or so and the road's washed out. So we're going to walk from here. We're going up this way. Let's go see what we find. There's a waste pile up there. Road's a little rough. I've got my big shovel with today. We had some report that this portal was collapsed. Here I am on top of the waste truck pile. It's a pretty decent size. Goes over this way too. Here's Tom. Looking for the portal. So did you find the portal? I did, it's right here. Boy, I think you got your work cut off. There's a lot of stuff that's been coming down from up above here. I can't even shine a light in there to see if there's anything in there, but that's where it should be. I just dropped that huge rock down there from right here. Boy. Can you try to chop that one in half? Mm -hmm. oh. We're digging it. Look at her go. She's a real mine explorer. Well, we've dug out quite a bit already. That big rock and a bunch of littler ones. That big one's about a 300 pounder. Luckily it was loose enough that we could roll it out of the way. Okay. Nope. We're here at the top of another waste pile. There's some footings for equipment up here. Here's one of the old ore cars. No. I don't know what this is. An old car, that's for sure. Here's another footing for some equipment. I wonder what that is. It's hard to tell, isn't it? the waste pile. There's a nice wall.
Got a Jeep over there, that's ours. Let's go inside and look. Well, let's see what we have here. Back to go. Do you want to go ahead so we have something to look at? Sure. So, we're in another mine. Don't know much about this one. So far it's nice solid rock, that's for sure. No timbering. Some large vent pipe. Boy, it's warm, isn't it? Yeah. Large diameter vent pipe and the duct tape that held it together. There were some cat tracks outside of here, so we're kind of being careful. And burrow. And burrow droppings inside of here. Boy, is it humid and hot in here. Wow. It seems like it's going to get wet, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. Okay, let me go ahead and get out of there. You okay? Wow. Something killed a bird and ate it there. Some feathers. Yeah, there were cat tracks outside here. It looked like bobcat tracks. Big vent pipe. Here's the water. Where this rock on the floor is. And it is humid. Oh boy, howdy. Oh my God. Stifling to breathe almost. Go straight back. No signs of track being in here. I'm guessing there might have been though. It's the walls are just damp. All the vent pipe is on the ground. There's a bit of a wide spot. been pretty straight so far. There's the portal. One little old piece of timber up there. There's some vent that's still hanging. That looks like 12 inch. Wonder what they're reminding here. You, this is gold country. There's some more vent pipe that's still hanging. Yeah. Scared myself. So this is either backfilled or at any rate that's it. That's a pretty sight, isn't it? Yes, it is. 
Well, after a short walk, we're getting closer here. This has several different piles and a tank of some sort. Over here, there's a couple big piles too. We're coming from that way. We are on top of the waste pile. Pretty good sized. There's about a couple more sections past which you can see. Looks like it's a big vertical shaft over here. Maybe there'll be a cool ladder system in it. Okay, so this is looking down the shaft. I can't see a lot. There are no ladders. There's a big collar that has fallen in there. And a lot of other timbers. And I can't see the bottom. It's, it's pretty deep. Well, we're heading over to the next waste dump, which is straight ahead on this road, about another quarter mile. Well, this is looking into our next shaft we came to. It's got a steel beam with some chains around a wooden beam and a cable. Back here there's a equipment foundation or footing. Here we are at a steel head frame on an old mine. It's got a ladder over there. One section. Two sections. And then no more sections. Looks like the shaft is plugged maybe a hundred feet down or not quite that far. So this looks like it would have been the mill. This is fairly modern judging from the concrete, the look of the concrete. And there's a huge head frame of some sort that's toppled onto the mill parts. That looks like a large water pipe. Another small tank. Below me are the two 55,000 gallon water tanks. And the one has a pretty cool uh, deck for supporting it. It's a strange contraption. I don't know what it is. It looks like these things might fold out. It's not like a, a spring where you can wind the spring up for something. Oh, the spring still works. Look at that. Ouch. I think you can stand up. Oh. Okay, let's go check it out. It's warm. It's good because that wind is getting a little cool out there. There's a vein they're working on. Yeah. Hey, old drill holes. Yeah. So this is looking down this shaft. It's a three compartment shaft. It's got a manway. And it's got a place for the main ore haul. This is on top of the shaft. This is, looks like it was a big head frame here. It's all toppled over and toppled down towards the mill. There's a, uh, a big shaft here. Metal shaft. I'm not exactly sure what that was for. One of you guys will probably know. 
There's a really cool old door or something. Big moms. Let's follow Julie up the hill, see what else we find around here. That's the big head frame in the mill where we were. Everything's all gated up though. We can go look at that little cabin over there. Look at this item here. It's a big heavy weight. I don't know if it's part of the stamp for a stamp mill or but that chunk of steel weighs about 40 pounds and a big rod with it. This looks to be an older mill. This was the original mill. The bigger mill, the newer mill was put up after this one. That's what this is. What is this mine date to, the 1890s? Those are some big water tanks. This is the big tank platform. Pretty heavy duty. There's no tobacco can. Here's a round device of some sort. I have no idea what that is. Looks like it would have been would have had a hub of some sort. All kinds of junk down in the wash here. There's this other big tank. This looks like it was a tow truck. It's pretty cool. It's a 5000 series, 5700. Fortieth something. Okay, let's go check out the old cabin. It's still standing anyway. There's one of those old thermos. Here's a little fridge. Did you look in there? Uh, no, I, I didn't pull it open. But I in. Well, there's a little bit of everything in there. I'm not sure I would eat any of it. Some batteries. There's the old sink area. There's some water. If you're starving or dying of thirst, I suppose you could drink that. Looks like there have been quite a few mice and rats and stuff in here. Well, that's all for this video, you guys. Thanks for watching. We always appreciate it, and we will see you on the next adventure.